in many attempts to raise awareness and to call for a heightened consciousness about the future of AI. Um, in October, over 850 experts, including yourself and other leaders like Richard Branson, who I've had on the show, and Jeffrey Hinton, who I've had on the show, signed a statement to ban AI superintelligence as you guys raised concerns of potential human extinction. Sort of, yeah. It says, at least until we are sure that we can move forward safely and there's broad scientific consensus on that. So that... Did it work? It's hard It's hard to say. I mean, interestingly, there was a related, so what was called the, the poor statement was March of 23. So that was when GPT-4 came out, the successor to ChatGPT. So we, we suggested that there'd be a six-month pause in developing and deploying systems more powerful than GPT-4. And everyone poo-pooed that idea. Oh, of course, no one's going to pause anything. But in fact, there were no systems in the next six months deployed that were more powerful than GPT-4. Um, and coincidence, you be the judge 